Moving on to the fourth question. Show that diagonals of a square are equal and bisect each other at right angles. Now moving on to the solution. Let us note on the given information that he has given a square. So let us assume that a square A B C D As ABCD is a square, we can say that all the sides in the square are equal. So here AB is equal to BC is equal to CD is equal to DA. Now we are required to prove that diagonals of the square are equal and bisect each other at right angles. Here the diagonals are AC and BD. So we are first required to prove that AC is equal to BD and second thing they bisect each other at right angles so we need to prove that let us assume that diagonals intersect at point O here we need to prove that AO is equal to OC and OB is equal to OD and he says that they bisect each other perpendicularly we have to prove that angle AOB is equal to angle BOC angle BOC is equal to angle COD and angle DOA or AOD is equal to 90 degrees now let us move on to the proof now in the proof let us consider both the triangles that is in triangle ABD and triangle ABC AB will be equal to AB as it is a common side for both the triangles and we can say AD is equal to BC as ABCD is a square all the sides will be equal and also finally we can say that angle BAD in triangle ABD is equal to angle ABC of triangle ABC as in the square the sides are perpendicular to each other so here in two triangles, one corresponding angle and two sides are equal. So by SAS congruence rule, we can say triangle ABD is congruent to triangle ABC. We know that when two triangles are congruent, then their corresponding sides and corresponding angles will be equal. Therefore, here we can equate the corresponding sides that is AC is equal to BD. So this covers our first proof that diagonals of a square are equal. Now let us consider two triangles that is triangle OAD and triangle OBC. In this AD is equal to BC as all the sides of square are equal. Secondly, we can say that angle AOD and angle BOC are equal since they are vertically opposite angles about point O. And now let us consider that AD is parallel to BC and AC as transversal then angle DAO will be equal to angle OCB since they are alternate interior angles. Now again considering the same point that AD is parallel to BC and BD as transversal we can say angle ODA will be equal to angle OBC since they are also alternate interior angles. So now two corresponding angles and a side of triangles AOD and BOC are equal. So by 
ASA congruence rule we can say triangle OAD is congruent to triangle OBC so when two triangles are congruent then we can say the corresponding angles and corresponding sides will be equal so here we can equate OB is equal to OD and OA is equal to OC as OB is equal to OD and OA is equal to OC we can say AC and BD bisect each other now let us consider in triangle AOD and triangle AOB OA will be equal to OA since it is a common side we already proved that OB is equal to OD and also we know that AB is equal to AD as ABCD is a square so here three corresponding sides of two triangles that is AOD and AOB are equal so we can say that triangle AOD is congruent to triangle AOB we know that when two triangles are congruent then their corresponding angles and corresponding sides will be equal so here we can equate the corresponding angles angle AOB is equal to angle AOD now if we observe clearly angle AOB and angle AOD form linear pair about line BD so we can say sum of angles on a linear pair that is angle AOB plus angle AOD will be equal to 180 degrees which implies we know that AOB is equal to AOD let us replace it by AOD therefore we get angle AOB plus angle AOB is equal to 180 degrees that implies 2 times angle AOB is equal to 180 degrees which implies angle AOB is equal to 180 degrees by 2 which is nothing but 90 degrees so here we got angle AOB is equal to angle AOD is equal to 90 degrees now if we observe we got angle AOD is equal to angle BOC here so let us name it as equation number 2 therefore from equation 2 we can say angle AOB is equal to angle AOD is equal to angle BOC is equal to 90 degrees here we require to prove that another angle that is angle COD is also equal to 90 degrees we know that sum of angles about point is equal to 360 degrees we can say angle AOB plus angle BOC plus angle COD plus angle AOD or angle DAO is equal to 360 degrees which implies here we have AOB, AOD and BOC as 90 degrees so we can say 3 times 90 degrees which is nothing but 270 degrees plus angle COD is equal to 360 degrees that implies angle COD is equal to 360 degrees minus 270 degrees which is nothing but 90 degrees so here also we got all the angles about point O is equal to 90 degrees so we can say AC and BD bisect each other perpendicularly this is what we are required to prove